Hey guys, what is up? This is Nokia Head here, and today I'm reviewing the number 41 Ford GT. Um, obviously, I have two models here, they are obviously different. Um, so, first off, I'm um, starting with the white one. Uh, this one is not mint. Um, I got I got in a lot of different cars, um, but yeah, it's a pretty cool model still. I really like it. Uh, it's missing one rubber tire right here. Uh, I plan on getting a more mint one. Uh, I if I come across an extra tire, maybe I'll put it back on there. Um, this one originally had all of its tires, but I donated one to the yellow version. Um, so um, yeah. But as you guys can see here, it's a really high detailed model. Um, camera can focus there. Um, this yeah, this model is pretty, pretty well detailed. I see here as on the engine. You can see all the engine components um, inside there. Uh, it does have clear plastic windows on the front and the back. Um, the, the windows are open. You can see all the little lines on it. You can see the doors open and or the line that door is um, you see the red interior in there it's a right hand drive uh, it has yellow plastic hubs um, with uh, the rubber black rubber on them I don't believe you can get gray rubber on this car it only comes in black rubber yeah, it's a prequel cool model. It has the number 6 on it. You can get it with a rare number 9. If you're lucky, you can maybe find those often on an eBay. Um, here's the rear. The tail lights are not painted. And you can see the muffler is part of the base. And you can see some grill right here on both sides. It's a prequel cool model. It's really well detailed. I think they got this car right on to the actual one in real life. Here's the base, made in England by Lesney Matchbox Series number 41 for GT. Um, it's pretty cool. Um, I think the mint version will look way better. Um, so all the dents and scratches won't look or appear more better. Because white paint is really easy to see all the scuff marks and stuff. So yeah, it'd be look really good with mint paint. Uh, here is the more rare version. Um, this is a yellow one. Basically the same thing, but it's yellow. Uh, same red interior, same clear glass. Um, I really like this yellow model. I think you can only get these in the gift pack back then. Um, it would come in like a five pack. It would also come with the white one and the yellow one. Um, but I think I, I th the, the yellow one looks pretty cool. Um... But yeah, same number six, same rent here, same clear glass, same engine, same everything really. Um, it's just the color is different on the actual car. But yeah, it looks pretty cool. Here's a little comparison here. Um, so yeah, they're both the same really. I really like the yellow version. You can probably find one of the a couple of these going uh, eBay for like for around like forty dollars, not mint. Um, this one here I got for like 20 bucks. This one I got in a, in a lot, so I can't really put a price on that one. Um, yeah, the tires I got on this were not the correct tires that actually go on this model. Um, so I had to put um, a few, um, I, put a, I had to put a tire, I had to take a tire from this one and put on this one. Um, yeah, the rubber does fall off this car pretty easily on some of the hubs. Some of them stay on pretty well and tight but um yeah it's a very cool model very well detailed i really like it um hopefully you guys like this review make sure to subscribe and rate for more um uh, i'll be posting a lot of videos this week i am going to be uh recording a ton so i can post them out uh as much as possible and i'll uh, see you guys later